Hi, I'm John Sage with Sage Traveling and AccessibleCaribbeanVacations.com. I'm here on the Celebrity Silhouette, uh, one of the Solstice class ships, which are one of the, the newer of the, the celebrity ships. This is a great ship, and I just want to take a few minutes to talk to you about the accessibility of the staterooms on this ship. I'm here in an interior cabin, um, and I, I've seen the, the balcony cabins and the suites. The accessibility features are, are similar, but I'll show out, show, I'll, I'll point out a few things that, that I think Celebrity has done uh, very right on these ships, and there's just a, a few different things um, that probably could be tweaked, but overall accessibility on this in these staterooms is quite good. Um, so let me start off with the the opening, the door out to the the hall where you, you will come in from is wider than most of the the doors uh, into the normal staterooms. These accessible cabins have widened doors. There are. Um, there's also a motion activated, I'm sorry, a button activated uh, automatic system to open the door. So it's not one of these heavy doors that you really have to struggle with. You just press the button and it'll open up right for you. The, there's a, a small chair and a table here. Um, I have enough room in my wheelchair to get by here. There's not a, a problem. But if, uh, if you are cramped for a space, I'm sure it's no problem to ask to, to have that removed. Moving on to the closet. Uh, like other celebrity ships, uh, this closet has a, a feature which, which I, I really like, um, and that is that the, um, the, the rod to hold the, the clothes hangers, if you, if you pull the handle, which is over on the, the right, you can't really see it too well, but um, if you pull that handle, it will actually swing out and down. And so um, you can put long length clothing in here, long gowns and things like that, and then you pull it out uh, to, to be able to reach it. Um, other uh, staterooms that I've been in have two separate uh, uh, hanging rods, and they don't work as well. Um, they, they can't be moved, and the, the long uh, clothing can't be held, it can't be hung up at, at the top. That is the closet. Um, the desk and the, the TV, plenty of space over here, uh, plenty of counter space, plenty of drawer splay, space, um, there's a mini bar. Um, the desk is high enough for a wheelchair user's knees to fit underneath, so no problems there. Over on this side, there's enough space between the bed and the wall for a wheelchair to fit. Uh, likewise, on this side of the bed, there's even more space. There's plenty of room on uh, either side of the bed. On some cruise ships, that's not the case, and so you do need to, to be careful for that. Um, like on all cruise ships, these beds can be split into to twins uh, without a problem. Moving into the, the bathroom, and this is one of the most important areas to, to know about on cruise ships. So the first thing is that um, there is, it's, there's a slight inc incline. You probably can't see it in the video, but almost flat access to, to get into the, the bathroom. The sink is high enough where a wheelchair user's knees can roll underneath. No problems there. The bathroom uh, countertop is bigger than in other, some other bathrooms that, that I've been in. There's also some drawers and uh, some shelves where you can put, put your toiletries and anything else that you need. The toilet has grab bars on one side. So in this room, it's just on the left side. If you were in the, the opposite of this room, it would only be on the right side. I've seen some other cabins where they will have grab bars um, fixed on one side of the toilet and they will swing down on the other side of the toilet. So if you need that, you probably um, will need to choose another cruise line because as you can see, there are no grab bars on both sides of the toilet. Move into the, the bathroom here, showing you the roll-in shower. You can see that a seat is attached to the side of the wall and can, can be pulled down. One of the things that I don't like about um, this layout, and Celebrity does a lot of things great, is that they have a grab bar behind the seat. So you actually can't, you have to bend over a little bit to when you sit on that seat. You can't lean all the way back against the wall. So it, it sort of shrinks the, the size of the seat. Um, it is also sort of firm, so you may want to put uh, fold some towels to, to sit on it to make it more comfortable. The uh, handheld shower is, is available here, uh, or you can use the, the shower head above. This is common in a, a lot of cruise lines, no problem there. So 
Um, so when I travel, I, I sit on the, the chair, use the handheld shower, everything works out very well. Uh, I will mention that we are, uh, I'm putting an entire article together that will go on the website, uh, and so you can view accessibility photos and accessibility details of various other parts of the ship, including uh, the theater, the, the lounges, the restaurants, the pools. Uh, there's a lot of things that they really did, did well in the Solstice class ships, and you can view those on the, the website.